I'm Sharon and I'm Cecilia and we're from Kites and what we want to talk about today is child-led play and um, adding to your child's language and the fun experience being able to enjoy them while they do things that interest them so if you have a child and they're playing with this train they might just be moving it along around the track I might come in as a parent and just come in and go broom 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 and follow what that child's doing Broom, 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 broom. And rather than say, what's the train doing? Who does the train see? I'd be more inclined to say, I like trains. Trains are fast. And making some comments rather than questioning, 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 because that can feel too full on for kids. Um, and really what you wanna do is extend what we call joint attention. Both of you paying attention to the same thing, um, depending on their age, of course, and their developmental stage. One of the other things is you can always build in turn taking and functional language. So if we're doing something like this, uh oh, here you go, Cecilia. You have the green one. It's your turn. Oh, there we go. Your turn. Okay, it's Sharon's turn. Sharon's got blue. My your turn. Yep, on top. My turn. Oops, we lost one. Whoopsie daisy. <laughs> so that's a way that you can do it. So you can just take them all off and hand them, or you can give a pile to the child and a pile for you. Um, and that's a great way of doing it. Or you can always add in, oh, what is the man doing? Oh, he's a cheeky fellow. Oh my goodness, he's eating all our blocks. Yum, 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 yum. <laughs> oh my gosh, would you like some? Mmm, yummy. Um, 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 um. Oh, look, I've got this person for you. Oh, you want mm, some? Yum, yum, yum. Oh, yeah, they want some too. <laughs> so you can make sure that you add in some functional things that you do every day that you can add some fun in with the kids and they can do some imaginative play if that's the stage that they're at. If not, just follow what they like to do. If they're just at a stage that they're picking things up and going boom, you just copy and go boom. Yeah. yeah, and overall, we've said this before, but we just want to make it fun for the kids and let them sort of lead what they want to do rather than sort of, um, you know, putting our child in an interrogating situation and yeah. feeling um, too pressured to really enjoy the play. Yep. Yeah. Bye.